Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Was reading some of that James Hellsworth news this morning there. You know, if he did it, it's pretty fucked up. You know what I'm saying? But he has a lawyer or some law firm denying the accusations, shit like this. I believe he denied it himself. Or, um, the girl posted a couple things. She's apparently sending like proof to people if you ask her on Twitter. Different websites have obtained this proof from her. Um, you know, but they're denying it. Um, either it's real or it's a big setup of some sort. You know what I mean? The girl uploaded a two minute video or something on her Twitter. She's talking about how she has the proof, this and that. And so basically, she went to some indie wrestling show, something like this, with a 30 year old friend. Apparently, Hellsworth asks her how old she is. She says, I'm 16. Please follow me on Twitter, something like this. He, he talks to her on Twitter. There are screen caps of this. He asks for the, the Snapchat. You can see him adding her on Snapchat. And, you know, there's blurred out pics. I've seen a pic or two on Twitter of his cock or what is supposedly his penis. You know what I'm saying? Um. But they're denying it. Apparently, there's a video on no DQ. It says, click here to watch the video. Um, and when I click this video, I get a big warning there. Your computer might be infected. Do not turn off or else we're going to ruin your life or whatever. That's what happened when I clicked on it. So I suggest people don't click. To, to watch the video or whatever the fuck what like I saw people writing it's held hell's word flicking his tongue and uh, showing the penis stuff like this you know what I mean um, Grimm's toy show has uh, fired Hellsworth apparently he was working for him doing stuff on his page or his federation whatever the fuck it's called there so they seem you know Grimm's toy show he believes it he fired him I'm sure other people believe it honestly he looks guilty you know what I mean you can see him adding the girl, he's sending shit to her from his Snapchat, you know. Unless she's bullshitting and she told him she was 18 and send me the dick pic, I don't fucking know. And now she wants to frame him as a pedophile. That's the only way that it can be done. Somehow she lies about the age. Maybe we're not seeing the whole thing, but honestly, kind of looks guilty. You know what I mean? And if he was set up somehow, you got to be a dumb motherfucker. You know, a celebrity. You know what I mean? Why would you start sending dick pics to people like that there? You know, obviously people are going to share this shit. Um, you know, maybe he is a pedo and he wanted to get with this young girl. Maybe she'd be impressed by his pics because he's a wrestler. Whatever the fuck. Um, it's possible he was framed or something or lied to or... But uh, kind of looks guilty there, just saying he looks guilty. I'm not going to say I know for a fact that 
He thought she was 16 and sent her dick pics by purpose. You know, I can't say that there, but uh, looks guilty. You know, he sent dick pics to this 16 year old girl. Shit like this, you know. Pretty fucked up. Guaranteed we won't see him in WWE anymore, whether he's proven guilty or not, you know what I mean? Highly doubt McMahon's gonna bring him back after this. He might become the TNA World Champion someday. Still potential for that there. To become the TNA World Champion. But, um, yeah, denying it, there's a bunch of proof that he sent this shit. He added her fucking, what's your Snapchat, dick pic, all of that is there. You know, it would have to be a big setup of some sort. Maybe he, he'll play dumb. I didn't know her age. I don't fucking know, but the dude fucked up and he fucked up bad and he looks guilty. You know, maybe he's not. It's a, it's possible, but ugh, I doubt it. He lo looks pretty guilty. Until next time, peace. Uh.